about half of those experiencing homelessness in the United States have spent time in foster care. This is according to the National Foster Youth Institute. Well, now Colorado is launching a program to try to prevent foster children from ending up in the streets. Dinner 7's Danielle Kreuter explains how it works. Over the years, the outlook for people exiting foster care has been challenging. Colorado's National Youth in Transition database shows 36% of 21-year-olds who left foster care reported being homeless at some point in the prior two years. Until now, the only resources to help kids aging out of foster care find housing was the voucher system, formerly known as Section 8. That voucher program, while available to former foster youth, didn't have any special circumstances or provisions within it to actually meet the needs of these young people. And there also wasn't funding for things like deposits, for assistance with food if they needed it. The state's Department of Human Services recently launched a rental assistance program specifically for those who are leaving foster care. In addition, they are lacking supports, natural support systems, the same things that most young people leaving their families or their homes or transitioning to adulthood would have when they're becoming adults. The new program would assign a case manager to applicants to help them navigate their new life on their own in addition to that money for rent. To be eligible, people need to be between the ages of 18 and 25 years old, have spent time in the foster care system, and are currently at risk of being homeless. You could then get 70 to 100% of your rent covered. They would be required to contribute up to 30% of their income to the rental expense itself. If they don't have employment at this point in time, then it would be 100% until they get employment, and then the amount would adjust. Being on the streets is hard and is frankly heartbreaking, especially for this particular population. The goal is to create stable homes and eventually stable families in the future, something advocates say is critically important for those trying to make a strong start on their own as young adults. I'm Danielle Kreuter, Denver 7. And that program has been funded for up to 100 applicants. 45 have been pre-approved. And if you're interested in applying for a rental voucher, we have all the information you need on Denver7.com. Just look for this story.